does the dancer's journey begin? When does the bright flash of destiny illuminate the road ahead and affirm to the wandering soul that it's on the right path? There are signs along the way hinting that there is indeed a muse, a guiding force that pulls us through life's endless dance. Dancing through far off places, dancing toward the beauty of sacred places that inspire and lift the soul's expression to greater heights. In this life, I have seen that movement begets movement. My dance in art is fueled by my dance through life. I am a perpetual pilgrim, traveling to ancient wells of inspiration and mythic beauty, in constant courtship of the mysteries of dance and movement, whether I'm dancing with the elements or whether I'm dancing with fellow travelers in a celebration of life's journey. About a year ago, I heard the muse's voice calling me back home. I finally made it this year, in the month of July, 2007, back home to the fertile, fragrant hills of Berovo in the southeast corner of the Republic of Macedonia. These hills have sustained generations of my mother's clan, Matinsky. A rich historical range of cultural influences have shaped the local culture into a hybrid of Byzantine mystery and Roma fire. Welcome to Berovo, the scene of my early childhood, to which I've returned again and again. I had been gone way too long this past time, seven years, but the call was unmistakable, and I was drawn, mind, body, and soul, back to my roots. Младите не знаят. За това доведят младите са да ви питат. А, така. Ами да кажувам. Да. Да се разпитаме, да се научиме и ние. От и това, че падне на нас, да го предава. Във воде. Една хора го слагат, друга за тига вредеца. Извинява, то не за нас десната. То не мен бор. Така ще шо. Така е, деца са, деца са за нас. At the knees of my grandmothers, my young self learned to spin and weave the highland wool from our family's flocks, even as the grandmothers would spin and weave the legends of our people, their struggles, their joys, their heroes. Through evocative songs, a living history springs from the mouths of those born at a time when literacy was still a luxury. The rhythms of life, love, and death the rhythms of the year, planting, harvesting, and wintering, are all celebrated in these ancient songs and dances. In my own family, I was told stories and shown pictures of sheep shearing festivals in the highlands where the Roma would come to beat the drums and play the zurla, the gaida, and clarinet while my grandfather and his four brothers relieved their flocks of their thick coats of wool. Invariably, a lamb would be roasted, and they would all feast together in the highlands, Slav and Roma, Orthodox and Muslim, in the organic cultural mix that defies the popular political term, Balkanization. This is the Malashevo region, the Macedonia I grew up in, a unique cultural spirit distilled from Slav, Roma, Turkish, Bulgarian, and Greek influences. Here, in this region, destinies have intertwined for generations upon generations with the help of music and dance. And this folkloric legacy is being preserved and passed on to the younger generation due to the efforts of one remarkable man.